Hey, how's it going? You're looking at the Back to the Future time machines. The one on the left is the new rele newly released retro entertainment version. The one on the right is the mainline version. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and compare the two and point out the differences. First things first, uh, the retro entertainment version is metal base and a metal top. And these uh, boosters are metal. The only thing plastic on this thing is the windshield and the interiors. This one, however, is metal top, plastic base, interiors plastic, boosters are plastic, I think. Actually, these boosters might be metal screwed onto plastic here, which they are on this one as well. So that's all the same, other than this one has a plastic base, this one has a metal base, making this one a much heavier car. Um, here we have a blue tinted windshield on the mainline car and a very clear one on the retro entertainment version. They both say DMC on the front, which of course is the maker of the DeLorean. Uh, this one has a little scuff in the paint there, but uh, that's not anything. It's just a defect. Uh, the decos on the side are exactly the same. Sorry. Had a little bit off camera there. Okay, now on the back, a little bit more detail on the retro entertainment version. On um, the mainline version over here, it says, um, I don't really know what it says. I think it says DeLorean, and uh, it says that on this one as well. Now, I noticed that this bumper is kind of painted weird. Um, part of it's flat and part of it's shiny. I don't know if that's an error or what the deal is with that. I have like three more of these because I bought a case. I will check that out after this video and uh, see. Um, if I remember, I'll put it in the, in the comments what the deal is. Uh, the tail lights on this one are three colors. One color on this one. License plate on this one's more detailed than it is on this one. And uh, also, oh, I'm dropping cars again. <laughs> but not to the floor this time, just a small drop. This uh, retro entertainment version has some extra paint on the top, but the mainline version does not have. Of course, real writers on the retro entertainment version and uh, not on the mainline version. Overall, both of them are great cars. I, mean, I don't have a clue what year the mainline version came out. Uh, the copyright says... doesn't even say. So I have no idea. I have no idea when that uh, main line came out. If you know, let me know in the comments. That'd be great. This one, obviously, 2013. Um, another difference is the paint on the main line is glossy. It's a matte finish on, or a, not even matte. It's a flat finish on the um, retro entertainment version. I haven't found the retro entertainment version in stores yet. It should be coming soon, I would guess, um, so be on the lookout for those. They are in the C assortment, but uh, that's all I got on the DeLorean. If you haven't seen the Back to the Future movies, you should probably get on that too, because they are excellent and classic. But anyways, <laughs> thanks for watching. Please check out my other videos, and have a great day.